Hi, I'm Lee. I'm a product manager here at ECM Industries, and today I'm going to be talking about the Sperry Dual Check. So the Dual Check is a two-in-one tester that quickly and safely measures AC voltage as well as 50 volts, as well as tests outlets for proper wiring. It combines two of our most popular testers into one item. There's an NCV on one side, and then the outlet tester on the other side. Um, it's used by electricians, tradesmen, technicians, home inspectors, and even DIYers for simple home improvement projects. Um, so what is an NCV? Uh, an NCV refers to a non-contact voltage tester, so it's able to detect AC voltage without having to actually physically contact the conductor that's being tested. Um, so it'll measure AC voltage and detect it up to several inches away, um, and it'll indicate it with a beep and a flash. Um, one thing to keep in mind is it will not detect DC voltage, it's AC voltage only. Some applications that you use an NCV in, um, common one would be to trace breaks in wire. Uh, so I have an extension cord right here. Um, so extension cords get beat up pretty easily. Um, it might stop working on one end and you're wondering where the break is in the wire. Um, you can use the NCV to trace along the wire and detect where that break actually is in the wire. So you can see here the NCV stopped beeping at this point in the wire and that's to indicate that that's where the break is. You can see here that the wire is broken at this point, so the NCV stopped beeping and stopped detecting that voltage. Another application for uh, an NCV is to check if there's live voltage, uh, say in an outlet, for example. So if you're switching out an outlet, uh, you want to make sure there's no uh, live voltage in there before you get in there with your tools. Um, if you don't want to get shocked or anything like that. Um, so an NCV is a good way to quickly check if there's voltage in that outlet or not before you start working on it. Um, one thing to keep in mind is it's only a relative measurement and only tell you if there's AC voltage or if there's not any AC voltage. That won't actually give you the value of how much voltage there is in that outlet. If you want to do something like that, you should use a multimeter or a clamp meter that's able to give a more precise measurement. The second feature on the dual check is the GFCI outlet tester on the other end. Um, when this plugs into an outlet, it will basically trace how electricity is flowing through the outlet and it'll work on type A 120 volt outlets as well as GFCI outlets. So depending on the wiring of the outlet, the LED will light up to tell you how the outlet is wired. Um, so the lights will indicate one of seven common wiring errors um, by lighting up the LED on the side of the tester. Uh, the unique thing about the dual check is it uses a single LED with no chart, so it's easy to understand. Uh, this is in comparison to a typical outlet tester that you'd see, which uses a chart and three LEDs at the bottom. You have to match the LEDs to the chart to tell you what the wiring error is. Um, so it's harder to understand and quickly interpret. One common wiring error you'll see is reverse polarity of the neutral and hot wire, um, which is basically when the neutral and hot wires are reversed on the back of the outlet. Um, so basically what this means is the, there's still electricity flowing through the outlet, even if the appliance that's plugged into the outlet is turned off. Um, so there's an increased risk for electrical shock, because even if you think the appliance is off, there's still electricity flowing through it. The dual check is also capable of testing GFCI outlets or ground fault circuit interrupters. These are common in kitchens or bathrooms. This tester will test the GFCI basically by simulating a trip to make sure that it's working correctly. Uh, basically, you just plug it into the outlet, press the GFCI test button at the top of the tester, and it will trip the GFCI to make sure it's working correctly. If it doesn't trip, then you know that the GFCI is faulty and needs to be replaced. The dual check also has a patented battery test feature. Let you know that the battery in the tester is good before you start using the device. When you press the button once, it'll beep to let you know that the battery in the tester is good. It uses one LR44 button cell battery, which is included with the device. The tester is also CAT3 1000 volt rated, as well as having a 250 pound crush rating and a 10 foot drop rating with guaranteed durability. The tester is also backed by a lifetime warranty as well. So to summarize, this is a great two-in-one tester that reduces the number of items that you need to carry in a tool bag with you. If you have any questions or for more information, visit us online at sperryinstruments.com.